FNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrial Trading up 111, NASDAQ up 150, S&P's up 40. Gold, gold contract up $26.10, trading to 2,335 an ounce. We have silver up a buck, $27.69 an ounce, light sweet crude. Up 49 cents, seventy-eight dollars sixty cents a barrel. Copper, copper is up five and a half pennies at four sixty a pound. Get notes and bonds. Ten-year note up one tick, one twenty-eight oh twenty-eight. Thirty-year up nine ticks at one sixteen oh seven. And king dollar, king dollar is up twenty-four ticks, trading at one oh five oh fifty-four. Euro is at one oh seven. Yen's one fifty-three. British pounds one twenty-five to one U.S. dollar. We get over and take a look at the S and P, folks, and. What, what has it breathing out here today is that that dollar last week got into its lower range. Now, it's holding tight out here today. Uh, the SPY right now, you're up 390. Get a big contraction of volume. That being said, guess what? Bottom line, this still wants higher price, and it's getting relief from that good old U.S. dollar. We take a look at the note, and, I mean, the uh, NDX 100, the Qs, same type of setup. Now, there's a, there's a huge contraction of volume out here in general and this is everywhere if we go to the gold contract we take a look at gold now the gold contract has some good volume the gold equities and silver equities however don't okay so the bottom line we get 181,000 contracts in, inside gold we're 23.35 that wants higher price and then let's go to that dollar because the dollar you it's teetering right on at the lower range. That's how this thing is shaking out right now. So if we take a look at this, you're going to see you literally we're, we're above it right now. The lower range starts at 104,976. We got to 104,867 today. You're dealing with 105,054 because what you also have we have the note and bond market going with us, meaning going with you if you're a bull in the either the commodity market or the S and P. Both those structures are going with us. We take a look at the note and bond market. Friday, you went top side. You had volume behind the move. That's saying higher prices, lower yield are coming at us. So bottom line, you know, you get the window dressings over right now. And we'll see what's going to move this market. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.